Community-made mods can make certain aspects of games much more convenient. In today's video, we're going to go over how to install mods on a Lord of the Rings Return to Moria server. Before we get started, make sure to back up your server before installing any mods so you ensure you don't lose any server files. We will first go over how to install them on the server, then we'll go over how to install them locally. First, we're going to go to the Nexus Mods website for Lord of the Rings Return to Moria, and we're going to download any desired mods we want to add to the server. Next, we're going to log into our Bicetosten Games panel, and we're going to choose Lord of the Rings Return to Moria server. Next, we're going to choose the Stop button to stop the server. We'll then go to the Files tab, and we're going to go into the Moria folder, then the Content folder, and then lastly, the Packs folder. From here, we're going to choose the Create drop-down menu and select Create Folder. We're going to name this folder Tilda Mods, and then we're going to press the Create button. Once that folder has been created, we are going to upload any of our mod.zip files to this folder. Once those are all uploaded, we are going to right-click and choose Unarchive for each of these mods. Once those are unarchived within this folder, we can go back to the home tab, start our server, and we'll have installed mods on our Lord of the Rings Return to Moria server. And if you'd like to install those mods locally, we're going to first go to our Steam library, and we're going to right-click Lord of the Rings Return to Moria, hover Manage, and choose Browse Local Files. Within this folder, we're going to go into the Moria folder, then Content, then Packs, and we're going to create a new folder in this packs folder named tilde mods. We're going to go within that folder and any of the mods that we downloaded from the Nexus mods website, we're going to drag into this folder and then we're going to right click and extract all those .zip files within this folder. Next time you load Lord of the Rings Return to Moria, it will install all these mods and you'll have installed Lord of the Rings Return to Moria mods locally. Thanks for watching and check out bisectoasting.com, your ultimate gaming partner.